Folks are asking what's up with the water. Many customers are noticing a yellow tint to their tap water. We're being told it's a result of the heavy rain from earlier this week. Fox 6 News reporter Alan Collins joins us with more. And Alan, is there a health threat? Is the water dangerous? Well, Steve, we can tell you today the Birmingham Water Works Board, they're coming out and saying it is not a health threat. Now, it is definitely due to those heavy rains which hit the county earlier this week. Now, the Water Board also tells me today they're keeping their fingers crossed. They hope that this discolored water is gone in the next day or so. Over at Homewood's Wheelhouse Salon, they noticed there was something wrong with their water. It was just in the bathroom. I don't even think it came out of the sink. It was just in the bathroom, and we just saw it. And... It was just curious. The salon commode and tap water did have a yellow tint to them. Now next door at the corduroy crocodile, Mandy Hallbrooks, she noticed a problem at her Homewood house when she tried to take a bath. I noticed when I ran my bath water last night, I noticed that it was, it just looked dirty. I wasn't sure if I wanted to get in it or if I needed to run a new one. So this has nothing to do with pipes, nope. sediment, or chemical. Rick Jackson with the Birmingham Water Board says the utility has gotten several calls from customers throughout Jefferson County. Downtown Birmingham, Homewood, Hoover, Vestavia Hills, and down Highway 280. Jackson wants to assure the water customers that the water is not a threat. It is completely healthy. You can drink your water. You can cook with your water. You do not have to boil your water. Jackson says the material in the water is manganese. Heavy rains force the chemical produced in nature and the rocks and soil into their Shades Mountain watershed. Since that time, our guys have been out there uh, flushing the system over time. And as we continue to flush the system, you will see that water lighten up. So hopefully, hopefully within the next day or so, that water will be back crystal clear. Now, while the water board insists the discolored water is not a threat, Hallbrooks is taking no chances. I would rather not drink it. I'm okay with bathing in it and maybe even brushing my teeth, but I don't really want to drink it. Now, folks over in Hoover, they happened to notice the Hoover Fire Department out with the fire hydrants opening them up. Now, a lot of folks were believing that this led to this discolored water in the Hoover area. That's not true. You know, the fire department, they do regularly check the fire, fire hydrants twice a year. Again, not connected to this. Everybody's keeping their fingers crossed. It'll be gone hopefully by Monday. In Birmingham, Alan Collins, Fox 6 News on your side. Indeed, Alan, thanks.